final Orange Star mission, well, the regular missions at least, is up next. KOW Rescue with Max vs. Adder. I'm pretty sure the lab is here. Pretty sure. And oh yeah, uh, just bought the final thing from Hachi's shop. You mentioned that was the last thing, so it should be the last thing. So Hachi will hopefully not come in anymore to interrupt at the end. You know, I will kind of miss it since he's been there throughout the game. Good old Max. Even though Adder hasn't fought Max yet so far. But I guess this is like the second time around. Or something like that. I don't know. Indirex. Yeah, that is a little bit weird. Either way, this mission shouldn't take too long. Yeah, I got the Enderox, uh, no bases, the many cannon on the top left. Hmm. Max doesn't do that. Oh, man. Redeploy. Uh. Even without redeploying, uh. totally beatable. Love Max's firepower. At the very least, this mission should be easier than like the Advance Wars 2 counterpart. Because the AI doesn't cheat. Lots of force to hide in, gotta destroy the black well, don't have to destroy the cannons, but it's probably easier to. Just gotta get like a I don't know. MD tank and a tank in the forest and then just destroy the sting or something like that. I don't remember exactly where all the indirects are, which is of course a good thing. Okay, so what do I start with? The mechs can probably just walk over the rivers and help get me vision, maybe? Maybe. Where's my APC? Oh, APC is over here. So, if I want vision... Probably these two. Well, definitely... This guy? I'm not sure where to start. Do I want like the mech on the mountain or do I want the infantry on the mountain? Since I think this guy's gonna go this way. For sure. Well, there's the recon so I might lose my infantry immediately, which is okay. I guess. I guess I should've went up here on the mountain first. Oh well. Yeah, I think my mechs are a little bit more important. So I'll, I'll let this guy scout for me. In that case, next is my tank. That's right in there. Just in case there's like something that pops up over here, that'd be bad. Uh, wow, this recon's like trapped in here, funny enough. Okay, cannot see anything there. I don't want my APC to die, so I'll do that. Cannot see anything up there. Yeah, I might lose this infantry. That's why I guess I'll just move my mech up and protect the rest of my uh, infantry. I shouldn't go too far up, but at the same time, I really shouldn't be too scared. That artillery is actually useless. When it's too range in this fog and the river, which I can't. Really shoot across. Ah, uh, fabulous. Guess I'll move. Well, let's say that there's a rocket here. One, two, three, four, five. So I shouldn't cross the river just yet. And I definitely want to protect my B copters if I can. That's for sure. Guess I'll do that. And the tank goes right there. Recon goes here. Two B copters will go. Uh, top, I guess, and the other two's gonna stay back a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. Now, let's see if my infantry dies or not. 
Ah yes, of course. I knew that there was gonna be an indirect. Oh, I, I know exactly what this artillery is done. In the forest uh, below the recon. I might just leave my infantry there. There's the ant here. Infantry right there. Not granting any vision just yet. That means there's, at the very least, there's no rocket here. At least not this turn, anyways. Okay, first off, it's probably my mech. There's a rocket there. I have to attack the ant here with a tank or by MD. You know, I would love to get rid of the other ones as well. Oh no, my B-Copter is going to attack there. That means I do gotta leave the tank alive. So I guess I sh could sacrifice a unit to the tank, which I don't mind too much. Let's see if there's anything in this forest. I guess. Hopefully I don't use a B-Copter for this. But I think I would like to do this. This B-Copter cannot attack anything. This B-Copter can only attack from this side. Okay, sorry, let me find this out a little bit. The ant here can only attack one. So if I kill him... Tank can kill here. I wanna see how much the B-Copter does to the rocket. 78, that's not a kill. Okay. I wouldn't mind the B-Copter attacking the tank and taking a little bit of damage back. I'm okay with that. I guess I'm gonna do this. Maybe sacrifice a tank shot. Well, if anything, I can probably move my recon in first. Maybe get a little bit of vision uh, up top. That means I might want to attack with my MD tank to the side. Just so that my recon can get full vision. There might be interacts on the cities as well, and I'm okay with that as well. Okay, I guess I'll start with this. Yeah, attack there. That's a kill. I really do want to see if there's anything in the forest. Since I'm gonna move in anyways, I guess I should just move all my units in. No, uh, like I said. Oh, Recon can go up here. One, two, three... Sorry. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this is as far as the Recon can go, so I should go full move. They're still outside of the mini cannon range. And my Recon's pretty important, actually. Ah, artillery. Okay. Since that is an artillery. I do want to go attack it. But I actually don't have enough units now. Can I get Max's power? No, Max's power doesn't grab movement. Well, since I'm command anyways, I might as well just go full in now. I'm, I'm really hoping that there's no unit in the forest right there. That means I attack here with this B-Copter. Yep, do that. Get him out of the way. At the very least, I can destroy the tank, I guess. And now I guess I'll, come, I'll protect my Recon from the left side. Oh, the Recon can still see. Great. Oh, uh, yeah. 
Can't hear a cat attack. But what? Oh no. Either way, I can't kill the. T well, I can kill the tank. It's just that I cannot attack the artillery, which is a shame. Especially since the recon does get vision back there, so the artillery can attack my recon if it wants. I'm just really hoping that my recon doesn't die. At the very least, my MD tank is outside of the artillery's range, which is good. Uh, yep, I do have a tank, another MD. I guess I do have another recon as well. But I'd rather have two recons. Okay, I'll finish him off. One thirteen. Oh, my infantry on the mountain might die since I did hear some copters. So they might be coming in soon to attack. I guess I shouldn't leave my infantry here. Yeah, I'll, I'll just go right there. I'll start the other artillery range. And maybe see if uh, any more units like, comes through here or not. Okay, I guess I should move my rocket first. Artillery next. Yeah, an MD tank. B cop. Uh, I, I really do want to check if there's anything in here. Kind of doubt there is actually. I guess I can put. Well, first recon. And then tank. And then a PC goes right there. Mech. But there is a missile here. One, two, three, four, five. Oh yeah, I gotta protect my recon over here. Two, three, four, five. So I guess I'll put this beacopter behind the infantry right here. I'm not gonna go across and attack a recon. Rather save my beacopter. Day two. Oh yeah, I gotta check terms. That's a cannon fire on my beacopter, that's fine. Rocket? No, that's the artillery attacking. Am I gonna lose this tank? Oh, oh yeah, the city's not captured. So there's not nothing on them. There's a tank. That means I have one tank left and two MD tanks. The recon attacks my beacopter, interesting. For that one damage, that's kind of stupid. Oh well, good for me. That's a tank. Oh, there's the MD tank. Possible... Sorry, if possible, I do want to destroy the mini cannon now. I don't think that's possible though. Uh, I can definitely kill these two. I think the MD tank plus something else can. Well, one of my decopters can take down the mini cannon. Probably. I don't think there's any units in the forest since. No one moved in there and nothing attacked from there. The mech can take care of the recon. I think my two B copters can take care of the tank. Let me see how much damage this does. 59. That's a kill. MD tank can kill the artillery and then... MD tank attacks here. No, I guess I should take care of the MD tank and then take care of the mini cannon later. Let's wait. I do have my uh, ant here to attack. But I'm pretty sure I heard copters. So where are they at? Oh, nothing in there. Okay. Just in case there's a missile here. One, two, three, four, five. So I guess I'll go up here. Nothing. 
I don't really need Vich anymore, so yeah, I'll go in there. Okay, if this infantry that dies, this infantry dies. Since I do want vision of, of the artillery when I do come over here. And this uh, infantry isn't going to do much anyways after. Rocket can probably just go full move. Oh yeah, I still have this tank. That means I can attack here probably. Yeah, 46. Oh, I might still be able to attack the mini cannon then. And still attack the MD tank as well. We'll see. Gotta maximize my efficiency with my units. Check the ranges in the back and all that good stuff. Max does have power. I could pop it now. But do I need it to pop it now is the question. The Sandy tank cannot attack anything else, so it is gonna kill the Yeah, artillery for sure. I think I'd rather keep my MD tank alive. Because of how powerful they are. Okay, this does 66 and 66. And this one does 30, 96. Okay, in that case. I, I think I do rather finish off the, the MD tank, honestly. Yeah, and then I'll leave the mini cannon for next turn. You know, my MD tank is gonna get attacked, which is a shame. Or I can just destroy the mini cannon and then it's around. No, I need my MD tank to attack. So it's, rather, it's either 3 damage or a lot of damage from this MD tank. In that case, I think I attack with my D copter first. Yeah, get that 30 in. Take 0 damage back. Okay, I see nothing. Okay, 66 should be a kill. Unlike uh, the mini cannons, the damage does stack up here with luck. So yeah, these two can kill the MD tank, but they could not kill the mini cannon. Oh, artillery can actually be useful here. And then I guess the recon's gonna go in front. Since I do have two recons, I guess I should sacrifice one. Since I'm pretty sure there's a unit in here somewhere. Somewhere. I said attack from the front here. 27. Mech kills as I planned at the beginning. It just uh, came way late into the turn. I think I'm not going as fast as I should. But that's most of the units destroyed with me only losing one unit. Probably isn't a bad thing. And here I can go there. Drop off my mech right here. Gotta protect my APC since this is the only one I have. And that turn... It's either gonna use superpower. 7 HP. Oh well. I do have cities that I can uh, heal on. Which is a good thing. Recon moved dead, but nothing's attacking, so I guess there's nothing in the forest up there. Well, that artillery's having fun. That's a pretty dumb move. Power. Okay, these two are giving me vision. Cal okay, and this uh, infantry's alive, so there is only one artillery there. There's also an MD tank moving forward too. Wait, oh yeah, terms. Route. Yep, defeat enemy troops. Pay attention to the woods. 
sure. Are Tilly actually gonna help me here? That's 40, 33. No, I, I shouldn't capture. There's actually no point in capturing. The city's back here, they're way too far away. Okay, if I wanna get past, probably best to attack with a VTOP there and my recon. Or two B copters. One, two, three, four, five. The MD tank can attack the recon. So I don't have to worry about that. Oh, that's 54. Wow. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, I'm going to save my superpower. I don't need my superpower. Guess I'll attack here with this B copter. I kind of want to check the woods to make sure there's actually nothing in there. Since this is defeat all enemies. It seems that they're hiding, then I gotta like, smoke them out anyways. 88. And then the last B copter is gonna attack from the top. Sixty-three uh fuel left. I guess I could just check the fuel. Oh, sorry, check the woods and waste some fuel. Okay, not then. Not then. I, yeah, that was a lot of fuel though. Oh well. Mini cannon right here. I can kill it with, uh. Yeah. MD tank and two B coppers. They should be in position right now to attack. You know some of them are damaged, they should do enough damage to destroy the mini cannon at least. Tank? I guess I'll be MD tank that goes here and destroys that. Rock is local full move after oh, a couple of units, my units get out of the way, I mean. Like that. Yeah, I guess it's fine to go here. since. I also wanted to kind of see what's in that forest as well. So I might actually just pop my superpower after. Maybe. Just gotta move on my units. Uh, oh yeah, I didn't turn off animation since there's not much capturing here. And that's another turn over. Oh, I'm stupid. I can't believe I actually put that B-copter in range. Wow. I guess I just want to be in range of the forest with all my units. After I destroyed it, well... If I destroyed the tank. Oh yeah, Max still doesn't have super power. I do have three B copters. Sorry, for all four. This one can reach the backside, so let me see how much damage I can do to the cannon. This guy can also reach up here. Does that mean I leave the tank alive? Well, I just don't know if there's any unit back here, or over here either. Wow, I just want space off. Well, I guess the tank attacking and my units here doesn't really matter too much. That's a 46. That is a 27. Oh, shoot. That means that I do need my full HP beef up to attack if I want to destroy this thing. I guess I should have checked before I actually went in. Wait, how much will the ant here do? Probably not as much. Yeah, 12. Unfortunate. That's fine. In that case, I guess I'll just destroy the tank then. Yeah, I just have to destroy the tank then. Plus two move, one, two, so I can totally just attack the tank right here. 
40. Okay. Maybe the two B copters can't kill, but at the very least, I can surround the tank. Attack from this side. Even if there is something in the forest, that's okay. I'll just take care of it next turn. And here can go like right here. Recon can go right here. Does that need fuel? Uh, 57. Probably not. I don't want to sacrifice my mech, I don't think. Ah, uh, it should be okay to go here. Since at the very least there's also some cities to uh, heal if I have to. And my second mech is like also right here. Okay, we'll see what happens. Rocket first, artillery second, and then my two recons are actually in the back, funny enough. Do something like that, and then go right there. I, I guess I should put that recon in the city to refuel. Oh well, my PC is gonna make it eventually. Just like my infantry is gonna make it eventually. Superpower? Still no superpower. Artillery is in the forest. I'm not quite sure what gave vision of the MD tank though. Yeah, what gave vision of the MD tank? Oh, oh, the the one HP tank, of course. All right, another artillery in the forest. I know exactly where you are. MD tank right there. And a rocket. Well, after I kill all these guys, they shouldn't have vision to attack my mech from this space. Superpower now doesn't make much sense. Since I don't really have a target, unless if I just superpower and then cross over and destroy these guys. Which I might just leave my rocket here to attack the... The anti-air, honestly. So that these four can actually just cross over and destroy all these guys. Nothing else attacks, so at the very least there's no rocket here and there's no indirect here. But I still want to check it. If I do check over you, it'll probably be my recon. Actually, no. Yeah, why, why don't I just run in? Okay, and then my recon... Going there is a bad idea, since this recon will good vision. So I do check, it has to be my B-copter, which I will put right here. I'll destroy the artillery with tank. Yeah, plus the B copter. Do I combine some of my B copters? I wonder. No, probably not. Not with Max's superpower coming up soon. Yeah, probably not. It might be fine to attack here. There might be a missile. It may not be a missile. We'll see. Attack right there. Oh wait, I don't have to get, get in range of these guys. Since I can attack from the top, actually. Okay. MD tank attack here. And then I guess I just put B copter in front of the MD tank. Maybe. Well first I think I do this. Attack with the mech. Oh wait, the other mech might not be able to kill. 4 HP. 1, 2... Well, maybe the recon can finish the job. Maybe. 31. 
Ah, uh, yeah, 1 HP. I definitely don't want this guy granted vision. Actually, it doesn't matter that much. The rocket can't attack, the artillery can't attack. The only thing that can attack is probably the MD tank. And the, yeah, 2 vision, so it can only see up to here. So if I sack an infantry, well, infantry or mech. That means the MD tank is gonna get uh, preoccupied. And I can destroy the MD tank after. Well, the rocket's is gonna take about, oh. One more turn to get in position. So my B-copters do have a, a little bit of time. So they can come down and help. Destroy the tank at least. Yeah, I think I attack here. 102. Oh, I don't even need my B-copters. Okay. Yeah, I think I do fix my MD tank a little bit. Nope, not gonna fire. That's a waste of a turn for my uh, rocket. Is that attack right here? Ant here, not attacking air units, but just a tank. So I guess Adder doesn't have any air units. I'm surprised about that a little bit. Okay, I guess the infantry can also bait. No, 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 no. What the hell am I talking about? The artillery and the rocket will be able to hit. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. This is like the safe line. And just like before, as I said, I think I do just move a B copter in front of my MD. Since if the MD wants to attack this MD, there has to, either has to pop the superpower. Okay, I'll do that. And I guess I'll also move this B copter down. Just in case I need it. Especially if I want to attack the artillery in the forest. Okay, Rocky goes there. Recons can also probably start moving down. Like so. Cause I'll put the artillery there. Yeah, both of them will go down. That's fine. Now let's see what happens now. Yeah, and I also gotta check if Max's superpower is gonna be useful. Still no other superpower. Is my mech dead? 8 HP on the city should be fine actually. Nope, I'm wrong. That's okay. The rocket's gonna come up? Artillery rocket. Actor actually has a lot of units here. Okay, rocket's gonna be in position. Attack, attack. It might take three turns to kill it. We also have uh, maxes in the reps. There's a superpower time. Well, first, I guess I should move my APC. But I want to see. Well, I, I guess I don't really need my superpower time. I'm gonna cross over here and attack. Honestly. Yeah, I think these guys are more important. Especially with the second artillery right there. And these guys can come down and help out. And then afterwards, go beside my APC for fuel. Yeah, my APC can like, refuel on these cities. Rocket doesn't have to move anymore, so that doesn't matter. Well, I can also go back to the city. Yeah, I think I do pull my superpower now. Let's go plus 40 uh, firepower. Give up! I don't know why, the way Max says it is pretty funny. Okay, time to destroy all the units that I can. Uh, One unit 
Whoa. I just have to destroy the rocket and then attack the artillery after with a different unit. My tank can go all the way there. I think it has to be my MD tank attacks the MD tank. Yeah, 79. Zero damage back. And here, I should be able to finish the job, honestly. Wait, can I destroy the rock is my other question. Okay, let me see. 72. 88, no. I think I'd rather use a B copy for that then. I guess the... Oh, okay. Do I need that though? Well, I guess the mech can attack the artillery. Same with my infantry. And now I can see how much damage that does. I think I go here. My tank can... Oh, it actually can't reach anything. So it will destroy the artillery. Sorry, not, not artillery. What am I saying? An anti-air. It will start with A's. That's taken care of. I probably don't need to heal anymore for this MD tank. Well, I should, but I can also heal right here. If I attack the rock here, I'll probably attack like with these two. Yeah, I guess I'm not in too much of a hurry to destroy these guys. But possible, I, I do want to move these two back up. That means I should save their turns. But I don't think that's possible, since the rocket is kind of in, in a choke point. That's some nice damage though. One HP, so it'll be the nine HP that comes. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about, about this uh, artillery. That's my bad. Yeah, I guess I attack here though. Actually no. Well, one of them has to go to attack the destroy the artillery for sure. I also gotta see how much damage I can do to this guy. Okay, I guess I attack here seventy four. Down it to oh, if only my infantry was on the mountain, they could cross over and destroy the artillery. Oh well. Now who's gonna do more damage? Uh, 64. 22 funeral. Left, that's fine. Oh yeah, definitely the B-copter here. That means I'm leaving the rocket alive. Oh, that's a one-shot. Nice. Now, even if I attack the other artillery with my 10 HP, B copy, it was on the force, so I probably won't get luck that lucky hit in like before. That's okay. Infantry, artillery. Yeah, the empty tank is gonna come down. Might as well with the plus two move. I'm still having to, to combine these two by sure. Oh yeah, since I am going away a little bit, I guess I can refuel now. Like that. And like this. I guess that's it. There might be a missile in the forest down in the center. So I might lose my V-Copter. Nope, I'm still fine. If a tree sees my V-Copter, but I guess that doesn't matter too much. Sounds like there's an APC in here. I guess there probably is. 53. Oh, I can kill him next turn. Nice. Okay. So, where do I want my APC? I do want to refill both of my B-copters. 
So yeah, this spot is probably the best. So I'll do that. Go do, do, do. Oh, no, no, not that space, that's what it is. I feel right here. And these two are just gonna like wait outside. You know these two can't kill anything. But they can at the very least damage like the rocket or something. Okay. Back down. Recon has 17, but my APC is coming, so I should be okay. Guess I'll go like right here. I should be able to see the rocket. There we go. And there's the ant here. Which has two visions, so I shouldn't be able to see my units even if I go in and kill. Which I guess I will attack with my recon. I'm really hoping there's no like rocket or artillery on the other side of this force right here. Uh, full HP MD tank wants to go forward. Artillery, I guess, wants to go right here. Doesn't matter too much. Mech will heal. MD tank, I guess, will also heal. Tank. Uh, and here. I don't want off top. But at the same time, it doesn't matter too much. Something like that. Get fixed, get fixed, why not? Since I can't move forward just yet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7... Cannot go in the forest to attack the artillery just yet. I did lose quite a number of units. Hopefully my technique score doesn't suffer too much. A battle with me oh. is a greater honor than you deserve! Superpower. Finally. Sidewinder! <laughs> now what? There's a rocket somewhere. And somehow Adder has enough vision to see my MD tank. How? Oh, there's probably also another recon in the forest. Unfortunate. That's okay. The rocket is in one of these forest tiles. Right here. Unless if it's like up here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it could also be up there. I guess my infantry can check here. Not then. I do want to destroy the ant here for sure. So I guess I do this. Even if I do risk another attack from the rocket. Oh, not that yet. That's fine. You know I don't really have a way to destroy the mini cannon, but I can just like avoid the mini cannon. That one anyways. Oh, the recon can attack. Okay, that means I start moving in. Right there, and I attack right here. At the very least, I don't have to worry about Adder popping a superpower anymore. Yeah, recon and infantry should be able to kill. Now, oh well, my infantry can get vision after. I'm just hoping my artillery will be in the right position. <laughs> Destroy the ant here. 57. And then I guess I just killed the rocket. Since my rocket can also come here and attack the recon after. Ugh, 27. That's pretty bad. Oh well, better than nothing. Since it is on the HQ. Nothing there. Another 27. I can destroy it next turn. And nothing down here either. Good. Kinda scared. 
I'm always scared of the... The missiles, I guess. Okay, nothing in that forest. And how about this one? Nothing in that forest either. With that done... Oh. I can finally get fuel for my APC. My mech can probably go forward now. Yeah, that should be fine. Yeah, there's no area, so... I don't really mind if this uh, anti-air gets attacked by the rocket either. Now, artillery... Well, the rocket could also be here. Because I do have my B-copter as back hook. 5-6. Okay. If the... Rock is right here. I won't be able to attack it with my B copter if I get vision with my infantry. That means, at the very least, my artillery should park right here. No, I should park right here. Whoops, I got my logic backwards. Like, if my infantry goes down and the rock is right here, then the B copter couldn't attack. That's why my artillery should have been right, like, uh, right in that space. That is my bad. Oh well. Okay, all the rest of my units will go up. I might lose my MD tank, but that's fine. Tank goes right there, and a recon. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We'll go right here. Hopefully get refueled. Day 9. Hopefully my B-copters can make it so that I do finish this map faster. Now what's going to the rocket go attack? My artillery maybe? Yep, my artillery, that's fine. That means it's in one of the force to the right or the bottom. Since it's not the one beside the artillery. Recon when it tapped. That means my rocket's not being range. That's okay. APC moved in. Oh. Wait, then... I guess the recon can uh, probably move first then. I'm hoping that... Rocket is in this space. It is. Okay, that means I definitely want to attack it. That's 62. I should be able to finish off the rocket up top. Ah, there's the recon. And I do have power. But since I'm not finishing the map yet, I don't guess I don't really need my power. And like I said, I don't really care about this May cannon, do I? But I do want them to be outside the range. Oh wait, I guess I should get vision just to make sure that there is actually nothing in that in that city right there. So APC goes first. I feel my recon. No, my recon could go... Actually, my recon can go pretty far. So I should probably scout with my anti-air. Nah, but doesn't have enough vision. Two vision, so it should be my recon. I do want my recon to go like super far up if I can. Actually, no, there's a recon up there. It's fine. Okay, nothing. I see. Oh wait, no, tank attacks here. 20 fuel left should be enough. MD tank goes right there. The rocket wants to attack my artillery, it can. It should survive. It should. I'm hoping. Yeah, it should be good. I was thinking of moving my mech up, but I probably shouldn't. Yeah, I probably shouldn't. Oh wait, rocket can attack the rocket. Nice. I didn't expect that. Oh well. That means my other B-copter can also come down. Since I don't need, uh, yeah. Guess I attacked the recon then. Oh. Another artillery. Good thing I spotted it. Okay, that means I attacked the recon here. 
46. Okay, it's a good thing I didn't combine these B-Copters. They're actually doing quite a bit of work by themselves. I think I pop my power next turn. This infantry might come up. That's okay too, since I do have my B-Copters plus my rocket up here. I guess I should move my artillery away. Ah, that's okay. Now, time to destroy you. Well, next turn. Since I forgot my infantry is 2 HP, so it won't actually do... Well, can't do damage damage. Oh, 2. That's actually not bad. Maybe I'll get super lucky. I think the 2 HP infantry can finish the job. But I want to move my mech. I guess I'll move my mech right, right, right there. Day 10. Delicious. Power? Oh, power. Side slip. <laughs> I guess the power's for the rocket. And a uh, recon, I guess. No, that's okay. My empty tank should be fine. But I think it is time to combine them. Since it is only a 2 HP empty tank. Taxi infantry, which is fine. Infantry is only here for vision, anyways. Force, that's annoying. Especially since I need vision in order to attack it. Why attack? Well, I guess I don't really matter. It doesn't really matter. Even if the infantry goes by HQ, I have tons of units here to attack him. 20 feel left for a tank. Nah, it's fine. Power grant plus one move? It does. It does, okay. In that case, I think I just leave this uh, artillery alone for a turn. And I'll destroy the, like, my tank and my B copter next turn. But I can need vision of it somehow. I guess that's where my 2 HP MD tank comes in. Okay, power time. Roll tanks roll. Max Force? Not Blast. Uh, yeah, probably not gonna get Max Blast. If the rocket attacks here... Wait, I guess I won't really mind if Adri goes on the HQ, since the rocket still covers it. If this B-Copter goes up... The show is that... I can at the very least attack the infantry, but as I said, I don't really need that. As long as my uh, B-Copter stays here, I can go back up and attack. Same with these two. If attacks here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... The rocket plus a 9 HP and a 5 HP B copter should be able to finish off this infantry. Okay, I guess I attack here. 1 HP, uh, uh, that's annoying, but that's fine. My, maybe my mech can help kill the APC after. Maybe. You know, I could also finish it off my B copter, which I guess I will do. Yeah, I'll do that. I'm just trying to make sure I finish the job next turn. Okay, with that done over here. The peacock is gonna attack this guy. Peacopter will attack the recon. Okay, I guess my other recon can go right here. Get in position. APC should be able to re oh, still can't reach the tank. That's okay. 
I guess I do want to see how much damage this does. 20, oh, 24, not bad. Maybe it'll go down to 1 HP. Okay, can my infantry do it? I think it can. Let's go. Nice. He caught the attacks for 61. Can, can should be able to make it? I can. I should attack from the top. There we go. I guess I don't need my 7 HP uh, MD tank, so I might as well attack the mini cannon with him. Attack like that. 103. Oh, what about the extra damage on recon? I think the tank could have one shot. Probably would have been about like 90 something. And then if I got lucky, it would be a kill. So I guess I didn't need my B copter over here. That's fine. If I have to chase after the artillery, I can. Okay, might as well attack. 53, why not? This recon is gonna finish the job. Like right here. You know, I would love to kill with the infantry, but it's too far away. That's fine. And here I can make it around. APC. I guess we'll refuel here. And then artillery. Kinda weird how all the direct units get plus one move, but then. Yeah, the artillery and the rockets don't get plus move. That's just how massive power works. But it's kinda weird when you think about it. Like how justice affects everyone. Well, all the tanks. There's the capture, which I'm okay with. Okay, last two units. And as I said, I might as well destroy this main cannon. Just I can. Okay then. Tank is gonna... Well, it still has 13 fuel left. So I guess I'll kill the tank here. Rocket actually doing work for me, surprisingly. In that position up there. Does have two ammo left, but as I said, I could just go back and get refueled. If I needed to. 51. And of course it's a B copter finish. Because we, the B copter stuff we did the most work. Especially with Adder having ant heaters that didn't really do much since I destroyed them before they could attack any important targets. Done? Should be done. Yeah, no lab for me. That's yes. fine. Yes. Yes. Oh, I'm pretty sure the labs are mostly in the top left or right cities. Yeah. I guess I'm doing the lab maps afterwards. Whatever. Like after Come the ca me. campaign's over. At the very least, I can show it off. Unlike the regular Advanced Wars 2 where you gotta redo it <laughs> if, you, if you want the lab maps. I totally should have captured those cities. Oh, I forgot about the lab battles I was going through. That's my bad. Wait a second. A lash experiment. Well, too bad I didn't get it. Yeah, that was the idea all along. Glad you noticed. <laughs> Whoopsies. Especially since I did have a lot of Mexican infantry. It'll take more than that. Not doing much. Me. Oh, but I got the perfect 300, which I am happy about. No, it's just gonna, gonna make the campaign a little bit harder. Not having Neo tanks. Well, that's fine. I, I don't use Neo tanks that much, anyways. Who needs Neo tanks when you have bombers, battleships? And MD tanks work just fine. Yeah, my uh, numbering is gonna be a little bit awkward, though. I could probably redo it off screen. Uh, I might just do off. No, I, I, I'm actually curious to see if it, if it will pop up actually after I finish the campaign. Oh, that'd be interesting to see as well. If it'll automatically pop up or if I have to redo the mission. Oh, we'll see about that. Anyways, yeah. 
no lat mount next time because it's gonna be uh the factory mission which does mean that i will skip a number oh well that's why let's just say it's for uh experimentation purposes yeah 